There is profound relief across a Madison West Side neighborhood tonight after a seven year old boy is found safe. News series Jessica Arp was there during the tense hours this morning and joins us now with more on where and how he was found. Jess? Well, the young boy was missing for more than 12 hours before he was found walking home from a friend's house, sparking a large police search. And while all's well that ends well, the Madison police say they wouldn't have done anything differently. Everyone looks after all of the children here, so um, it's very unusual that he um, is nowhere to be found. Trina Muick spent the morning worried about her son's best friend. He's always kind of the first welcomer, and so we're just hoping that with all the new families moving in that he's somewhere and that after the rain dies down, he'll, um, he'll come home. And that's exactly what happened. Seven-year-old Akash Panero was found just after 10 a.m. I thought this was the weirdest thing for getting lost. <laughs> what do you mean? Because it's so easy to find back home. His parents had not contacted the home he was found leaving because they thought the family was out of town. But it led to a scary overnight without their son. Holy. I'm fine now with police leading a search to find him. Very hard all night, they didn't sleep, you know, and police, they did the hard work. At some point, you've got to decide, are we going to do the all-out blitz here? And, and we did that. Madison police made automated calls to thousands of neighborhood residents and added billboards on nearby streets. We're taking a look at how we responded, uh, how would we do it differently next time. Uh, so we learn each time we do this. But as far as whether we would pull out all the stops and look for a missing child after that child's been missing for 12 hours, absolutely. A seven-year-old child shouldn't just go missing. And Akash says he won't be the child to go missing again. But what did you learn? I learned that I always have to tell my mom where I am. Good lesson to learn. Police say they had gone so far as to contact state and national authorities for help, but they found Akash before they were needed. His family has offered their huge thanks to the community for their help in the search. Oh, such a happy ending. Thank goodness. Jessica Arp reporting from the newsroom tonight. Thanks, Jess.